My name is Paul Nguyen, Technical Marketing Engineer. This is a video to demo TrustSec and Wireless LAN Controller 8.4. 8.4 enables software-defined segmentation to extend to the wireless network, including the ability to classify and using inline tagging and SGACL enforcement directly on the access point. We're going to demo a wireless peer-to-peer -peer blocking using TrustSec between contractor and employee on the same wireless network. Before we show the effect of TrustSec, let's go over how to set this up really quick. We start with ICE and configure the network access device for wireless LAN controller to support TrustSec. This includes RADIUS and TrustSec authentication settings. Next, we configure the security group policies or SGACL that is relevant in our demo, which is to deny traffic from any contractor to employees. We prepare the wireless LAN controller side to integrate with ICE. This includes PAC provisioning to establish communication between the ICE and the wireless LAN controller for TrustSec. From ICE, we can see that the CTS PAC exchange is successful. Next, we create our wireless LAN, enable 802.1x, and connect our wireless clients. For the purpose of the demo, we have pre-configured policies to assign the tags 5 and 4 to contractors' employees. We can see that the tags are properly assigned to each client. Next, we enable CTS on the wireless LAN controller to enable inline tagging and SGACL. We can see the security groups and security group policies have been downloaded to the controller. Drill down to the policies and we can see the SGACL and further down the ACEs per SGACL. If we console to the access point, we can also see the SGACL. And if we show counters, we won't see any counters hit at this time. So we begin some traffic. From our contractor, we're going to ping 10101010197. So with our iPad, we're going to ping our gateway. We have connectivity at this point. There's no hit on the ACL. We're going to start pinging the employee client. Right now we're permitted because we haven't, in, we haven't set the enforcement. So we go to the wireless access point and enable enforcement. And as soon as we do that, we can see the counters increasing. And we're denying the traffic between the contractor and the employee client over wireless network. Thank you for watching.